Welcome back everybody to another episode of Steam Free Play. Today we've picked out a game called The Nobby, The Nobbly, The Nobbly Crook. And uh, it looks to be a pretty strange game. It is a point and click style adventure. This is chapter one. There will be more chapters and it's titled The Horse You Sailed In On. I have no idea what we are, why our head is so inflated or anything like that. But we're going to jump into this game. We'll give you guys a little bit of a warning. I did read some comments about the sound being a little bit obnoxious. So I hope that um, that's not way too much true. The, the music here is a little strange. And I, I think that the people talking is not really talking. It's more of just gurgling or whatever they do. I think I can handle it. It's not that annoying. I hope you guys are not annoyed. Let's see what's going on. Hmm. Where am I? What is this stuff? What is going on at all? It's a federal offense to tamper with safety instructions. I don't want to touch that. What is this thing? Yeah, what is that? What is that thing? No one in that room? Maybe I should just talk to this guy. He's in some sort of weird contraption. Who's talking to me if I don't want... If it's not that dude, what is this thing? Trying not to draw attention to that. Alright, I have no idea. Back here? What am I supposed to do here? Walk, look. I can look. Oh, I can. Oh, I have other. Aha! So I have other abilities. I was just trying to walk places. I don't really want to walk anywhere, right? But I can look at things. I was already looking at things, was I not? What's going on? I'm awfully They're writing in Gookli, the Homageer language. I can barely read it. It seems to be safely instructed to torture devices. This is a torture room? Am I being tortured? Who's torturing me? Can I walk somewhere? How do I get out of here? Oh, look, we're moving! Oh, goodness. We've we've picked a path. We're moving somewhere. We seem to be on some sort of pole here. We can only go in this, like, slotted areas. Maybe we can go back here. Can I pick this thing up now? Can I take this thing? Uh, take. Yeah, I know that you're not trying to draw attention to that, but I want to take it anyway. I, I, I want it. Uh, maybe I should just go talk to this guy. Jeez, you sure- Oh, I'm, t I'm talking to him from across the room. Jeez, you sure do like purple. Everything here is purple, I guess. I'm ready to confess. I think I'll have a look around before I admit to anything. Um, I'm ready to confess to what? I didn't do anything. Purple is the color for pain. I, you know what? I like the color purple. I don't know if that's true about it being the color of pain. But uh, I'm ready to confess, I guess. Good, good. What's your name? I don't know what my name is. Plunkweedle the Frompenotter? Alright, Chef... I don't know what my name is. I have many names, none of which are pronounceable in your tongue. Ladies call me the Stallion. <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna tell him that my name is Plunkweedle the Flopinator. Is that me talking? I have a ridiculous voice. Nice try, Cyrus the Snip. I had... Alrighty then. I don't know what's going on. This guy thinks I did some sort of crime or something. Am I being punished right now? The theft confesses to me. Do you even think about what you take? I've got to know. Why do you do what you do? I, apparently I'm a thief and I take things and I deserve to be tortured in this crazy torture room. I do whatever the spooky voices tell me to do. Hold on to your, uh, squid hat and prepare for a tale of epic momentous. Some folks are born great, others have greatness come crashing down upon them. Like most stories, it starts with a damp hole. Okay, um, these are interesting <laughs> things that I can say. I think this is going to be me retailing a story to this sir, this guy. Let's see, hold on to your hat, or your squid hat. Is he wearing a squid hat? He's like inside a like robotic wood squid monster. Oh, Ocean at the cave's end, just like the spooky voices described. I should be tending to my crops right now. What crops? 
Is that me with my bulbous head? It is. I can't wait for my naming day to be called Osiris. Luna, maybe. Osiris the Seal? There's a lot going on here. I think I'm trying to pick out my name. Who is that guy? A spooky face, perfect. We have much to discuss. I don't like this thing. It looks like the Joker. No, no, you are me. Now listen. You must come at me, the peak of the knobbly crook. Right, sure. I'm just gonna head back home now. Osiris could have been. He's not even making sense. Both are apt names. He's calling me names! He's calling me out! Alright, sir. Creepy dude in the hole. Horse? Am I gonna jump in that hole? Oh! There is a horse! I don't know what... Chapter 1. I guess that was just the intro to the chapter. Here we are. We're on a big horse... Ship. Is this a swimming horse ship? Look, its legs are all upturned. Is that is that me way down there? All right, let's go ahead and what is this giant pair of scissors? Let's go check that out. It's not getting chopped, but I want to see what it is. Get the scissors. What is going on in this horse? Hello, sir. Can I? Uh say, perhaps, talk to you? Hello? He's angry! Oh, we're just moving to talk in a more appropriate area. Who are you? Who are you? Oh, he put his saw away! Oh, he's the calculator. The ship's a veteran and engineer. I'm only keeping this heap of load. And by all means, distract me from my work. Sure thing. Hey, right, well, he already told me what he's doing. What is the lower part of the ship like? How do I reach the lower deck? Can I borrow your saw? Maybe I want that saw. That's a good idea. I'm gonna try to get the saw. A saw permit? I was at the top of my class at a uh, saws. I'm impressed because you don't need a permit for a saw. I didn't think so. Why would I tell him I had a saw permit? Who needs a saw permit? You need a license instead? Alright, I'm done talking to this guy. He's crazy. He wants me to go into the knobbly crook to get a license to wield a saw. I should just take his saw from him. Yeah, I don't think he'd like that. I don't care what he'd like. It's welded to the ladder. What is it? Is that like a, a dragon head? Elevator. Let's go get in it. Get in this elevator. Can we uh, then use it? It doesn't seem to be working. Hey, mechanic! Come fix your freaking elevator, sir! We've got other things to explore in this hellhole. Where am I? Oh, jeez. Is this some sort of cantina? This guy is particularly interesting. Let's go talk to him. Leave this ship, ship. Only death death awaits for you in the crook crook. How do you know I'm going there? I have sight sight. This guy is creepy. Everyone here is creepy. I have not met a not creepy person. Thank you, sir, for your insightful clickery clackery whatever you're doing. Can I- Holy jeez, look at this dude! Oh my, I have, I have 10 score out of 300? Where did I get 10 from? There's so many people here. Is this cocaine? What is going on? What is on the floor here? This is awful. I don't, I don't know what kind of cantina this is, but there are people doing awful things here. This giant man is hunched over this powdery substance. Hello, sir. Let's go ahead and talk to you. You're very interesting. Is that the things that I can say to him? I'm stunned by his size? Yes, I am. 
Why are you bothering me? You're a boo gold. Can I have your triangle? Did you eat the other bars? Oh, that's stuffing! No worries, guys! It's just stuffing coming out of that bar stool. It's not any kind of awful things. Alright. Sorry for bothering you, sir, but um, can I have your triangle? It's worth a try, right? I'm just gonna ask everybody for everything that they have. No. It's for me to make ting ting when I'm angry. Why does he need to make the ting ting when he's angry? You would not like this. Alright, well. Sorry for bothering you, sir. I was just interested because you're huge. Whatever. Um, where else can I walk to? I have no idea what my mission is currently. I need to, like, go to the crook. Wherever the crook is. Is this like a one-man band? It's amazing. All right, sir. I have, have much more to explore. I don't think this is where I need to be at the moment. So I'm gonna be off. Off on my ship adventure. Maybe I should talk to this guy on the deck. Could be a good idea, right? What? What is going on here? The, the ship has like breathing parts. It's gross and I don't like it. And I don't know where I'm going. Just go in there. Oh. Where am I? Is that the, the helm? Can I steer this ship? Can I use that? Let's see if I can steer this ship. Dong? Alright, sir. I want you to use this, like, this. It's not a gong! That's obviously the ship's wheel. Alright. I guess I can't jump. What's that? I have things? Okay. Let's go ahead and remove ourselves from this area. I don't know what's up there. Or where I am. The scenery in this area is getting me a little freaked out. I'm gonna move. Oh, how did I get up there? That's where I went? That was the horse's brain? Oh, jeez. Yeah, I want to talk to this guy. What are these things? I have so many questions. So go ahead and look at these. Nail biter. Piggy bang. Panda Hailer. Alright, these guys are like pets? Or some Can I take one? Uh, how about this guy? Grumblings? He said, don't touch my grumblings. Alright, let's talk to him. What are these things here, sir? What is a grumbling? I know everything about grumblings. You're the, like, grumbling master? Why is the one on the end so small? Why are there so many Gurmling Balls here? Gurmling Balls? These are purebred Gurmlings, each finalist in its own ball, of course. I make sure they arrive safely. Alright, dude. Is it safe to have these things on board? What are they? A paper diet. It keeps them calm throughout the trip. Is he gonna give me some paper? He's gonna, He's gonna give me some paper. That is interesting. Maybe I can use that for something along my journey. Now, I'm done talking about the Gremlins. I don't think he has anything else for me. Um, let me get to the Nobly Crook. How do I get there? So we're going the opposite direction? This is not good. Not good at all. Alright, sir, I'm done talking to you. I now have 20 points out of 300. I gained another 10 just by talking to people. I don't know how to get to the knobbly crook. I'm not going in the right direction, obviously. Somehow I can 
get this ship to do something here. Let's, um, can I, can I go, can I go to anywhere other than the scissors? What are those scissors? Can I take the scissors? Why are there scissors there? I'm so confused. That is just irrational. I have no idea. Let's go back to that bar. Maybe somebody in there will tell me something about getting to the knob. And maybe I can tell this guy to fix his this dang elevator. Let's um, give him one more toxie. Because, I don't know, that's just maybe... Hey, sir, what is the lower part? How do I reach the lower part? What's down there? No, the lift is broken, sir. Ah, it needs fuel. Of course. It's a bleed engine. It needs paper. I just happen to have some paper. Liquid. I have paper, but I don't have liquid paper. Maybe I need to just, like, refine my paper into some sort of liquid paper. Um, thank you, sir. I already asked if I could borrow the saw. No, 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 sir. We don't need to borrow the saw. Goodbye. Yes. Excuse me. I have the paper. Let's go ahead and see if we can use this lift with the paper. If not, we're gonna have to figure a way to make it liquid. I don't know. I don't need liquid paper. I do have paper, correct? There's my paper. Very nice, nice. I like the paper. So let's go ahead and go into that bar. Maybe somebody in here can distill our paper into liquid paper. I don't know. Sir, anyone, hello. I have paper, can you make it liquid? How do I do this? Um, maybe the bartender has some insight for us. Bartenders are usually uh, nice and talkative here. Um, what do you serve here? Do you realize one of your patrons is dead? There's a dead patron in here? I didn't see anybody dead. Um, what do you serve here? Do you serve liquid paper? Yes! They do! They serve liquid paper! Yeah, I would like a cup of liquid paper. Wait, so I need a cup to get a refill. I need a cup, sir. Alright, well, maybe that gives me an insight of how I can get some liquid paper in my in my hands here. I can get a... If I can get a cup, maybe from this sir right here, who happens to be holding a cup up a little bit precariously. Can I just jack it from him? He did! I just took it! <laughs> Classy, very nice, thank you. I mean, I was gonna talk to him about it, but it's better to just steal it, right? Now you, sir, I have things for you. This cup maybe will be good for you. I'd like a refill, sir. Certainly. Oh, thank you. Even if you did return his cup, what are you talking about, sir? I don't want to toast because I don't want to drink this liquid paper. I actually want to use it in the said elevator to get down to the lower levels now. Junk. Liquid paper. Put in machine. Okay. Use machine. Banzo! It looks like the fuel goes here. Oh! Elevator is all up and running. Let's go, sir. Proceeding down. I don't know if this is the, the crooked knoll or whatever we're trying to get to right now. The nookie... Oh! I've got 5,300 points! I must be making some good progress here. We have made it down into some sort of stomach thing. 
which is really, really gross. But, um... Are things, like, digesting in here? Can I talk to these dead animals? It's a creep Creepy skeleton bird thing. Thing. No, that's just a regular skeleton bird. How do I... Is that a tapeworm? Gross. How, now where do I go? Hmm. Now, if I decide to go back up in the elevator because there's nothing I can do down here. I need some sort of raft or something. Is that elevator going to need more liquid paper when I get out? I guess I can just go get a refill with my cup. I have it, right? My cup's gone! The cup is gone. So this is my only chance to come down. Unless the elevator is just like permanently running now that I... What can I do? The shit must have swallowed this fish. Stomach acid. Yeah, well, I can't do anything with that. Right? Can I, take it? I don't want to carry that around with me. Okay. So, I guess there is nothing that I can do down here? I'm gonna risk it and go back up on the elevator. But what? So, this is not where I needed to go. The elevator was just a foolhardy mission. I don't know if I could do anything down there, but maybe we will come upon something here that will show us what the stomach down there will be helpful for. Maybe we can, I don't know, throw some paper in there or something. But, for now, I don't know where we need to go. Maybe if we can get in here... The captain's quarter or something. What is this like rune here? Let's uh let's take a look at this. I need to I need to accomplish something. Symbol for captain. See, this is what I'm talking about. We need to get up there. This is the captain's quarters. I need to control this ship because I need to turn it around. Is, can I go in that like disgusting hole in the ground? It doesn't look like it. Can I turn the ship around so we can go back to the crooked knoll nooked Where where am I going? <laughs> I have so many questions for this game. Let's see here. Let's go ahead and take a look at this. It's a wheel gong. So it's like a horn for this old boat. But um, I really want to use it. I don't want to gong it. I want to use it to control the ship. Sir, you don't understand what I'm trying to accomplish here. Maybe he can go farther here into... The area? Can you go up here? No. I'm a little lost. I'm a little confused. I don't know where to go. So, who else can I talk to? How do I get this ship to stop? How do I just want to get on my feet on dry land. Then I can figure out where to go. Because currently... I think that I need that saw for some reason, but I don't know how to acquire it, or what I need it for, even. I could, I'm gonna talk to some more of these people, maybe I get some more insight. Thank you for your service. He's like a, like a, a microphone person? I don't know what he's doing. Walk, walk, walk. Let's go... I talked to this guy already, he's kind of like a weird seer. I've talked to pretty much everybody here already, except for these two people in front. Let's see if we can give them a, give them a talk. What do you got to say, sir? I need to get to the Nobby Crook. That's where we're going, the Nobby Crook. The Nobby Crook! Okay, where is it? In the other direction. Can I fly? No, I cannot fly. I need to turn the boat around. Find another boat. I've already, I've already, do you have anything I can use? Do you have anything? A skinny thing? Oh, a shiny thing. Can I have it? Thing for a thing. Alright, what do you want? I have a piece of paper. I've got a piece of paper. Something with the wings. Jack likes wings. I don't have anything with the wings, but I'll be back because I would like to trade with you even though I don't know what you have. You have something shiny. Let's go ahead and talk to this lady. Maybe she has interesting things to say as well. 
You're a seeding? won the no, cup last no, year. We did. Cancha, She's some sort of sporting no, event no, master. No, I don't know. Pick a pocket? I don't know. That was not a helpful conversation. I'm still very lost. I guess maybe we'll give a second talk to this guy here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We don't have anything to say to him. How about... All right, never mind. This doesn't seem like there's anybody in this cantina that's gonna help us out with our mission. I don't exactly know what we need to do. Maybe I should go feed some paper to these knoblings or whatever they are. What are these guys called? Can I like give them my paper? Paper! Would you like to eat this paper? <gasps> he doesn't want it! He eats paper! That's what he told me! Right. Put that paper back in our junk. I don't need it. Walking. I really don't know what to do. Can I... I want to wake these grummerlings so that maybe we can cause some havoc or something. I don't know. Oh, maybe get this ship to turn around. It looks like I could just turn a go to the wheel and turn around myself. Maybe I don't know how to drive a ship or something like that. I don't exactly know. Let's I already explored that area pretty thoroughly. I have no idea what I should do. Maybe I should go back and talk to this guy one more time. It's got to be something to do with the stomach acid, but what? can we do with the stomach acid? Who is interested in some stomach acid? And how do we give them this stomach acid that they're interested in? Um, nice miss. I have a pouch too. Interesting. I don't, I don't know what to do. I've, I've become stuck, but you know what? For right now, guys, um, we're gonna have to go ahead and save the game here, saving it, and I will be ending off the episode here. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, leave me a thumbs up and I'll continue playing this game. And I will be continuing it and checking out the rest of this chapter at least if we enjoy it. We'll continue on to the second chapter. For right now I'm having some difficulties, but in the next episode you'll be sure to... I will find out where we need to go in between so we don't have so much wandering around lost but for now guys as always i'm chronic mischief thanks for watching and i'll see you next time thanks so much for watching make sure to leave a like or a comment below and subscribe for more chronic mischief